सेकेंड क्वेश्चन भगवान आई वॉज एस्किंग हाउ द कॉमन पीपल विल डाइजेस्ट योर क्लेम्स आई फील दैट यू आर समबडी क्वाइट एक्स्ट्रा ऑर्डिनरी बट जनरल पब्लिक एज वेल एज बोथ द राइट विंग एंड लेफ्ट विंग मीडिया विल ट्राई टू सबोटाज योर मूवमेंट आई सी सदगुरु जग्गी वासुदेव्स पॉइंट ऑफ नॉट कॉर्नरिंग हिमसेल्फ विद सच क्लेम्स I think that in the present era of materialism people value entertainment over authenticity. Aren't you giving opportunities to the existing controversies to thrive? Vamshi has asked this question from the United States of America. Vamshi, I have never worried about what others think of me. I am simply doing what I have come here for. I am telling everybody my truth and I am faithful to myself and this existence. That is enough for me. What Sadhguru does or believes is purely his own concern and I have nothing to do with that. I am simply not deriding him for his unscientific claim which says that if you give a glass of water to somebody with an evil intention it's going to harm and curse the person you see i am not saying anything you simply tell me did i say that his unscientific and rogue in saying this did i say i didn't say or did i everybody in the indian news media has come to know about my reincarnation and i have proofs to justify this claim of mine perhaps many people who know me well would have seen the evidences on the basis of which i am stating this coming back to your question vamsi inquiring about serving the recreational needs of the people in this respect i would again say that i am the greatest showman on earth i will not disappoint the people you just said that i am risking my mission by making such a huge revelation of calling myself the rebirth of osho yes i am osho definitely i am it's my own truth i have experienced it on my own in my own reality others hold no strength to challenge me and neither are they accountable to this claim of mine i have said in my own conscience and i am responsible for the consequences that it may lead to yes i will have to suffer a bit because of the hostility and disbelief of the people and especially the hatred and condemnation of many of my own sanyasis would follow but i would again say that god should forgive my own sanyasis for they don't know what they are doing and whom they are trying to blaspheme and admonish i pray to god that they should not suffer due to this blunder of theirs I have no disgruntlement due to anybody's disapproval and dissent. I am here for my own purpose and joy. I am not desperate to get the worthless and unremarkable certification or validation from anybody. I have something to offer to the masses and I am doing that. What else do I need? and why should i worry even you see i am one man 27 years old and i am facing the excommunication hatred and attacks of thousands of people every day and you simply see how audaciously and happily am i facing all this in fact it would not be right to say that i am facing all this rather I am simply enjoying all this. I sometimes laugh seeing the stupidity and incapability of my own disciples. 
I sometimes laugh seeing the stupidity and incapability of my own disciples and I get sometimes sad and concerned as well to see their ignorance and I feel pity to witness their hypocrisy and illiteracy even after several decades have passed since I left my body as Bhagwan Sri Osho Rajneesh. My close disciples too left no stone unturned to hurt me and attack me. But I don't care. I simply don't care. I am here talking to you and that's what matters to me the most. I simply love you all and I'm here for all of you. Just for all of you. I simply love you all. I simply don't care. I'm here talking to you and that's what matters to me the most. I simply love you. I simply love you all. And I'm here for you all.